If it were done when tis done, then to well it were done quickly. If the assassination could trample up the consequence and catch with his surcease success, that but this blow might be the be all and end all here. But here, upon this bank and shoal of time, we jump the life to come. But in such cases, we still have judgment here that we but teach bloody instruction, that being taught return to plague the inventor, this even handed justice commends the ingredients of our poison chalice to our own lips. He's here in double trust. First, as I am his kinsman and his subject, strong both against the deed, then as his host, who should against the murderer shut the door and not bear the knife myself. Besides, this Duncan has borne his faculty so meek, have been so clear in his great burden that his blessings will show like angels trumpet-tongued against the deep damnation of his taking off and pity. Like a naked newborn babe striding the blast, or heaven's cherubim forced upon the sightless couriers of the air, shall blow the horrid deed in every eye, the tears shall drown the wind. I have the spur to prick the sides of my intent, but only vaulting ambition which o'erleaps itself and falls on the other. How now, what news? He had almost sucked. Why have you left the chamber? Have he asked for me? No, you not, he has. We will proceed no further in this business. He hath honored me of late, and I won golden opinions from all sorts of people, which should be worn now in their newest gloss, not cast aside so soon. Was the hope drunk, wherein you dressed yourself? Has it slept since? And wakes it now? to look so green and pale at what it did so freely. From this time such I account thy love. Art thou a fear to be the same in thine own act of valor as thou art in desire? Wouldst thou have that which thou esteems, the ornament of love, and little coward in thine own esteem? Letting I dare not wait upon I would, like the poor cat in the act. Pretty peace. I dare do all that may become a man who dares do more. What beast was it then that made you break this enterprise to me? When you durst do it, then you were a man. And to be more than what you were, you would be so much more than a man. No time nor place did then appear, and yet you would make both. They have made themselves, and that their fitness now does not make you. I have given suck and know how tender it is to love the babe that milks me. I would, while it was smiling at my face, I plucked my nipple from his boneless gums and dashed the brains out. Had I so sworn as you have done to this? We should fail. We no. fail! But screw your courage to the sticking place, and we'll not fail. When Duncan is asleep, let you the rather should his hard day's journey soundly invite him. His two chamberlains will I, with wine and wassail so convinced, that memory, the warder of the brain, should be proven in the receipt of reason of women that go When in swinish sleep their drenched natures lie as in a death, what cannot you and I perform upon the neck of it? What not put upon his spongy officers, who shall bear the guilt of our great quell? Bring forth men, children only, <laughs> for thy undaunted metal should compose nothing but males. <laughs> Will it not be received when we have drenched with blood those sleepy two of his own chamber and use their very daggers that they have done? Who dares receive another? As we shall make our griefs and clamor roar upon his death. I am settled. And bend up each corporal agent to this terrible feat. Away. And mock the time with fairest show. False face must hide with false heart. <laughs> 